so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Whoa! Hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at where we're at today. You don't know where we're at? Yeah, because it's an illusion. <laughs> today, we're at World of Illusions in Hollywood, California, and this place is so awesome! But first, I have someone really important to introduce you to. Yeah, it's my best friend. Hey, Blippi. Hey, everyone, I'm Mika. Yeah, this is Mika. She is my best friend. Oh, Blippi, you're my best friend. Oh, no, Mika, you're my best friend. Oh. <laughs> I'm so excited to get to hang out with you today. Yeah. What are we gonna do? Well, we're at World of Illusions. Whoa, I bet there's so many cool things to look at. Yeah, there is. And I brought my camera so I could take some pictures. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> Look at this place. Whoa. Did you see us? We were so miniature back there. Yeah, we were so little. And now that we're up close, we look bigger. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> and speaking of big and gigantic, Whoa! Everything in this room is gigantic! It's so big! Whoa! This is awesome! Whoa! Whoa look at these! Whoa! Whoa! They're giant eggs! Wow! Let's count the eggs together! Okay! One, two, three, four, five, six! Six giant eggs! Yeah! Wow! And they're love... so colorful! I was just going to say that! Favorite. Ooh, I think this one because there's yellow and purple, and I like all these stripes, this cool design. Whoa! And I like this one because it has orange and this kind of bluish color. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, look at this! Whoa! Wow! Check it out! Huh, we're sitting in a giant dog bowl! Whoa! <laughs> The dog food in here would be so massive! Can you imagine the dog that would eat from this bowl? Whoa! That would be a gigantic dog! Yeah! <laughs> Definitely not a chihuahua. Oh, no way! <laughs> wow! Do you have any pets at home? Whoa! <laughs> cool. Ooh, let's go explore! Yeah! What's over here? Whoa! Whoa. What? They're giant! Headphones! Yeah! Normally headphones are so small and that go on your ear. But these are giant! Yeah, they're really big! This would be for a giant's ears. <laughs> That's silly. Whoa! Look at this! Oh, fabulous! I love this unicorn! Yeah, she loves unicorns. Uh, hey! <laughs> Do you want to ride it? Yes! Oh, can you help me? Yeah! Okay, thank you. Here you go! All right, actually, uh -huh. I'm going to step up here. Okay. Here I come. All right. Whoa. Whoa. Be careful. Whoa. Whoa. Where are you going, Mika? Oh, I think I'm just going to go get some ice cream. Whoa. Ice cream on her unicorn. <laughs> <laughs> that is so silly. Whoa. How do I look? Well, you look really good. Maybe I should take a picture of you. Oh, yeah. Whoa. All right. Say giant unicorn on three. <laughs> One, two, three. Giant unicorn. Wow! Whoa, this is gonna be such a great picture. Woo! Let's see. Check it out. Oh, I love it. Thanks, Flippy. You're welcome. Hey, Mika, I have a great idea. Why don't we go play some hide and seek? Yes. Yeah. Have you ever played hide and seek before? Yeah. How about I hide? Okay, and then you can help me find Flippy. Oh, we'll count together to five. All right. All right, go ahead. Okay, close your eyes. Everyone, close your eyes. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Ready or not, here I come. Hey, come help me. Do you see Blippi? Let's see. Is Blippi by the giant eggs? Hmm, I don't see him there. Oh, maybe it's a big dog bowl, Blippi. Hmm. Let's go back to the giant headphones. Not here. Maybe behind the really cool unicorn. Blippi! Where is he? Hmm. Blippi! I'm over here. Did you hear that? Blippi? I'm right here. 
right over here. Flippy! Yay! 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 You found me! <laughs> I was hiding behind the eggs the whole time! I didn't even see you when I looked the first time. <laughs> Did you see me? <laughs> oh, nice. That was awesome. Hey, let's go play some more hide and seek together. Oh, yes, I want to hide. All right, let's go. Whoa! Check it out! We're in a kitchen! Yeah, look at this giant piece of cake! Oh, it looks so yummy! Yeah, ooh, I wish it were real! <laughs> <laughs> Me too! Ooh, looks like it's a vanilla piece of cake! Yeah, and look at these yummy pink layers! Maybe strawberry! Ooh, or raspberry! Yeah! Whoa! Ooh, and the frosting up top! Ooh! Yum! Sprinkles and... <gasps> Whoopi, look at this! Whoa! A giant cherry! Yum! Yeah! A piece of cake with a cherry on top! <laughs> Whoa! Look over here! Whoa! Whoa. It's a blippy cup! Whoa! Blippy <laughs> teacup! Yeah! This big saucer! Wow, this would be a really big tea party! Yeah! A blippy tea party! Yeah! Whoa. Nice and warm! Whoa. Whoa. Why don't you take my picture? Yes, that's a great idea. <laughs> All right. Okay. I'll say tea party on three. All right. Ready? Yep. Flippy tea party on three. One, two, three. Flippy tea party. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. How does it look? Let's take a look together. <gasps> Whoa. I look so small. Yeah, the cup is so big. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Thanks for taking my picture. Of course. Whoa. Ooh, thank you. Whoa. Wow, it's so big. Look at this kitchen counter, Blippi. Yeah, we wouldn't be able to reach any cookies if they were up there. No, it's so <laughs> tall. Oh. Or if there are some bananas. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Or some broccoli. Ooh. Whoa. Nope. What, what would you want if it was up there? Ooh, I think I would want a nice tall cup of orange juice. Let's get Yum. <laughs> Will you close your eyes with me and count to five? All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, ready or not, here we come. Okay, did she buy the cake? Hmm, where are you, Mika? I don't see you by the cake. Do you see Mika by the cake? Hmm. Not seeing her. Huh. All right, what about the teacup? Mika, where are you? <laughs> I don't see her anywhere. Whoa, where could she be? Mika, oh, maybe on top of the kitchen countertop. Mika, where are you? Oh, is she up here? Whoa, oh, no, I don't see her anywhere. Do you see Mika? Mika, where are you? I'm behind you! What? She said she's behind me, but I can't see her. Do you see her? Mika, where are you? Mika! What? She's behind me? I don't see her! What? You're saying that she's in the cupboard? Okay! Mika! Yeah, we found her! Good job! I love playing hide and seek! Yeah, that was so fun! Yeah! Well, shall we keep exploring? And Mika.
Mika was a lot closer to you, and I was further. Yeah, when I was closer to you, I looked really big. And when I was further away, I looked small. Yeah. You want to see an example? <laughs> see my two hands? They're the same size. Yes, but if you move one hand back and the other one forward, this hand looks bigger than this hand because it's closer. Yeah. This place is awesome. It's really, really fun. Yeah, should we go explore some more? Yeah, let's keep looking. Yeah. Check it out! Oh, I'm sitting on an elephant trunk! Yeah! Whoa. And I'm balancing on an elephant tusk! Whoa! Let's sound like elephants together! All right, here we go! <laughs> Will you act like an elephant with us? <laughs> Whoa! Hey, Mika, I should take your picture! Yes, please! All right! Say elephant on three. One, two, three. Elephant. Whoa. Whoa. This is going to be such a great picture. Whoa. Oh, let me see. Wow. wow, it really looks like I'm sitting on an elephant trunk. I know. And it looks like I'm standing right now on the elephant tusk. Yeah, but if you come over here, come over this way. Yeah. You will see, I'm just sitting on the floor. And I'm just standing on the floor. <laughs> That's called an illusion. Yeah, this place is so cool. Yeah. Should we go explore some more? Yeah. Come Let's go. Come on. Surprise, Mama Chick. I'm not a baby chick. I'm Mika. Hello. <laughs> oh, Mika, what are you doing? Hey, Flippy, look. I just hatched out of this egg. You didn't? Here, Mika. Yep. Hey, Mika, do you mind if I take a picture of you? Oh, yes, please. All right. What should I say? How about baby chick on three? Okay. One, two, three. Baby chick. Whoa. All right. Let's see this picture. Ooh. It does look like you're a baby chicken. It really does. Thanks for the picture. You're welcome. Here you go. You Thank can you. That one. Woo! Woo! Whoa! Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> it's like we're jumping on a trampoline! Yeah, with a bunch of cupcakes! Whoa! <laughs> Wait a second! <laughs> Whoa, look at these cupcakes! What colors oh. are they, Mika? I see orange. Who likes the color orange? Me! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! And see a purple cupcake. Ooh, I love purple! Is that why you always wear a purple shirt? You know it. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. And a green cupcake. Ooh, it's green. Yo. <laughs> just like my camera. Another green. And look, it's not a trampoline at all. It's another illusion. It's just painted on the floor. Yeah. Hey, Mika, what cupcake would you want to eat? Ooh. <laughs> probably the purple one. Yeah. I would probably pick the orange one. Yeah, yummy. Should we jump some more? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, I love pie. Yum, yum, yum. 
yum yum. Whoa, this room is so cool. Wow, can we keep exploring? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> bye bye, kitchen. Bye. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, the living room. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> this is awesome. This big couch is on the ceiling. Whoa, I can almost touch it. Yeah, look at the chair. <laughs> Be a fun room to watch a show in. Yeah. Whoa. Be on the ceiling watch the show. Whoa. I have an idea. Why don't we have a living room dance party? Yeah, an upside down living room dance Whoa. party. <laughs> Good thing I brought my camera. Yeah. yeah, now we have this cool photo album. Yeah, we took so many pictures. Yeah. Ooh. What was your favorite part of today? <laughs> oh, right there. I love the elephant. Oh, yeah, that was so Ooh, silly. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. B L I. P P I Flippy! <laughs> Good job! Wait a second. Nika, how do you spell your name? Oh, I'll tell ya! It's N-E-E-K-A-H. Nika! Nika. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, see you soon! Bye bye! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey! Look at what I just rode up in! Yeah! It's a police car! And today, we are going to learn about police cars. what it is. It's a police car. Will you come check out the parts of the police car with me? Yeah, come on. Ooh, look at this light bar up here. There's the red lights and the blue lights over there. And speaking of lights, whoa, look at the spotlight. Whoa, whoa. Whoa! It's so bright! <laughs> Ooh! And the front of the police car has this push bar. This is used to help push vehicles off to the side of the road that are broken down. And then down here, this is a speaker. Listen! You there, clear the road. <laughs> That was awesome! Ooh! And one of my favorite parts, the engine. This is where the car gets all of its power from. Ooh! And the oil. Will you check it with me? <laughs> Allergy season. <laughs> okay. Ooh, look. Yeah. The oil looks good to me. So let's put the dipstick back and let's shut the hood and let's head to the back. Ooh, and look down here. The wheels and the tires. Oh, and look right here. Two words. The first word is Olympia. O L Y M P I A. And the second word is police. P-O-L, 
I-C-E, Olympia Police. And last but not least, the trunk. There's some cool stuff back here. Whoa, road flares. Ooh, a speed gun and some cones, even some caution tape. I'll show you this stuff later. But for now, it's time to dance. Inside the police vehicle with me? Yeah, come on! <laughs> Whoa! Wow! Now we're inside the vehicle! Look at this! Look at the switch, do you see it? I'm gonna push it all the way to the right, and those are the lights! Look! Whoa! Those are so bright. <laughs> okay, I'll turn them off now. Okay, I turn those off <gasps> and look at this. See, I just turned that on. That's the spotlight. Do you see it? Whoa. <laughs> okay, let's turn that off. And what else is in here? <laughs> Whoa. The steering wheel! Whoa! <laughs> and, um, ooh! The intercom. Hello, hello! I see you! It's Blippi! <laughs> That's funny. And, oh, speaking of noise and sound, look at this. This right here, this button. Listen. <laughs> yeah, that's the siren. Ooh, and the computer. <laughs> yeah. Woohoo! That is so cool. It's the Blippi police car song. Okay. And uh, I have some more fun stuff to show you over here. Come on. Shut the door. in here. This is the patrol bag. There's so many cool gadgets and goodies in here. Whoa, like binoculars. Whoa, I can see so far. Whoa, <laughs> hey. <laughs> okay, put those down there. Ooh, stuffed rhino. <laughs> A camera. <laughs> um. Ooh, flashlight. Hello, hello. So you can see in the dark. Whoa. First aid kit. Ooh. And handcuffs. So cool! <laughs> I like handcuffs! Okay, let's try it on. Put it on. Oh! Now that you have handcuffs on, you can't get them off! Ah, ah. But luckily, whoa! I have a set of handcuff keys. Put that right there. Do a little twisty. And then I got them off! It's like magic! Okay, let's put these back. Ooh, and last but not least, every police officer has to have a pair of sunglasses. <laughs> okay. Whoa. Now I'm a police officer. <laughs> Again, check out this. 
This is where you put the suspects. Whoa! The door doesn't even have a handle on it. And the seats are plastic and really uncomfortable. <laughs> Whoa! Ooh. 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 <laughs> I don't like being back here. <laughs> and no handles are like child safety locks, but for adults. <laughs> Hey, this is a speed measuring device. It uses a laser to bounce off a car and come back and it'll tell me how fast someone's going. We're out here on a street corner looking for speeders. There's one now. Whoa, he's going way too fast. Let's go get him. Officer? Sir, I need to talk to you about your speeding. Ooh, I'm sorry. What can I say? Heavy foot. <laughs> well, I'll give you a warning for today, but okay. we're just out here trying to keep everybody safe. All right, thank you. Speaking of that, Ooh. we're looking for this person. Have you happened to seen him? Oh, nope. That gentleman looks like he's wearing glasses. I sure don't. Oh, you're right. Well, let me give you this. Okay. Call us if you see him. Okay. Drive safe. Thank you so much. Bye. <laughs> Whoa, that? was a close one! <laughs> Hello! Hey! Let's look at what's inside the back of the police car a little bit better. Hmm! Woo! Look! We have a police officer's hat. <laughs> and... Yeah! A safety vest? Oh, and it's bright yellow. Look at it. Wow. Okay. Nice bright yellow safety vest. <laughs> How do I look? Okay. Oh, and I got my hat on. And oh, look. Four orange road cones. One. Two, three, four. Okay. Ooh, and look, a road flare. Wow. Put that in my pocket. <laughs> and road spikes. Okay. Set those down. Let's close the trunk. Okay. First things first. Ooh, road spikes. Take a close look at these. Wow, look at that. Whoa, those are sharp. Okay, let's put this right there. Put this over here. <laughs> okay, ready? Watch this. Okay. We're gonna set up this traffic course for the police car. And the police car is gonna make sure it doesn't drive on these because these are really sharp. Okay, let's take the four road cones and put one right here. Come on. And let's put the second one right there. One, two, And let's put the third one right here. One, two, three. And we got one more. Come on. Okay, how about right here? Ready? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Oh, I almost forgot. My favorite part, the road flare. Whoa, okay, this is not a toy, not for kids, so here we go, whoa, <laughs> okay, 
Okay, let's put it down right here. And let's start this course. Barely missed the spikes! <laughs> Good job! That was so much fun learning about police vehicles! Now it's time for the police car song! Dial 911 and the police will come driving in there. That was really fun singing, dancing, <laughs> to the police car song with you. Hey, I have something really important to tell you. You are very special. You are an amazing child. I am so excited to see what great things you do on our planet by making it a better place and helping people out. Last but not least, thanks for being my friend. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> well, I gotta go now. But if you wanna hang out with me some more, you know how to find me. Yeah, just search for my name. You know my name, right? Yeah, it's Blippi. B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi, that's my name. Good job. It's me, Mika, and today we're at Posh and Petite Playhouse in Woodland Hills, California. <laughs> Did you know this is a place where we can explore and be curious about different jobs? <laughs> I can't wait to try different jobs like an ice cream maker or a firefighter. <laughs> Come on, let's go! Which way should we go? Oh, check out this road! <laughs> Look, it's black with white stripes. Oh, black and white are opposite colors. Opposites mean they're completely different from one another. Kind of like, oh, 
night and day or hot and cold. <laughs> oh, check it out. Do you see that horse over there? Oh, let's drive our car over to him. <laughs> Hello, horsey. <laughs> I'm gonna name him Popsicle because I really love Popsicle. <laughs> Can you pretend to be a horse? Whoa! Oh, he's got a lot of horsepower! Let's go! Check it out! It's a marketplace! We can buy healthy fruits and vegetables here and make delicious meals! I know! Let's be a grocer! <laughs> All right, see you later, Popsicle! First, we need our basket! <laughs> oh, wow! Check it out! If we want to be a grocer, we have to get some items to put in our basket so we can ring it up. First, we'll need some alphabet soup. That's healthy and delicious. And how about some peas and carrots? And, ooh, mushrooms too. Check out all these healthy fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are good for your body because they help you grow strong. <laughs> I got it. Let's play a game. Fruit or vegetable? A carrot. It's orange and crunchy and bunny rabbits love to eat them. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> Do you know if this is a fruit or a vegetable? That's right, a vegetable. Great job. All right, how about this? It's a cucumber. It's green and it has seeds. Fruits have seeds and vegetables don't. Fruit or vegetable? Oh yeah, that's a tricky one. It's a fruit, even though it seems like it's a vegetable. But great job. Hmm. Oh, yum, a strawberry. Strawberries are really, really sweet. Is a strawberry a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> awesome, a fruit. One fruit point, please. Hmm, oh, look, a lemon. Lemons are one of my favorite colors, yellow, and they're really sour. Can you pretend to taste a sour lemon? <laughs> Whoa! Oh, sour is the opposite of sweet. Strawberries are sweet, but lemons are sour. Is this a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a fruit, just like the sweet strawberry. Okay, ooh, check it out, a piece of corn. Mmm, <gasps> that's delicious. Do you know if it's a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a yummy vegetable. All right, let's go check out now. Welcome to Mika's Marketplace. Oh, I see you got corn. And you're in luck, because we have a special on corn. Just one cent. And a lemon. And our sweet strawberry. And a delicious carrot. And alphabet soup, peas and carrots, mmm, mushrooms. Wow, you got so many healthy options. <laughs> oh, being a grocer is so much fun. We even got to help a customer take home delicious vegetables to make yummy meals. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Yeehaw! Hey, we're at an ice cream shop. I know, let's pretend to be ice cream makers. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Let's go! Welcome to Mika's Magical Ice Cream Parlor. What's that? Fresh baked cookies? <laughs> Coming right up. Look at that, fresh out the oven. Oh, they smell delicious. Let's count them. One, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve crispy cookies. Let's taste one. Mmm, that's delicious. Would you like a bite? <laughs> there you go. Mmm. <laughs> Do you know what this is? That's right, a purple popsicle, just like my horse's name. <laughs> Would you like a popsicle? There you are, one for you and one for me. Oh, that's really cold. Perfect for a hot day. Oh, those are opposites, hot and cold. When I'm cold, oh, it makes me shiver. But when I'm hot, oh, I could sure use a popsicle. <laughs> Would you like some ice cream today? Great. How many scoops? Oh, five scoops? Okay, here we go. One chocolate scoop. Two, a vanilla scoop. Three, mint chocolate chip. There you go, friend. Perfect. Four, a strawberry scoop. And five, a vanilla scoop on top. <laughs> wow, it's stacked up so high. <laughs> I love being an ice cream maker. I love scooping ice cream and tasting it too. Hey, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> Okay, let's see what other jobs we can do. <gasps> oh, don't forget Popsicle. Hello, Popsicle. Are you ready? Are you set? Go! <gasps> wow, check it out. We're in front of a fire station. A firefighter's job is to put out fires. Do you want to be a firefighter with me? <laughs> Awesome, let's go. This is a cool fire station. Oh, look, a fire truck. It's red and really long too. <laughs> and look at these trucks. Let's go park. All right, to the parking lot we go. <laughs> oh, and look at these trucks. They're really big. Oh, and these trucks are small. Big and small, those are opposites. How about this one? Big or small compared to this truck? Pretty small, right? <laughs> but what about compared to this one? Oh, now it's really big. <laughs> Do you hear that? It's a siren. Oh, we gotta get ready to go. Put out a fire. Hello? Yes? Fire? On one, two, three, fire road? Oh no! Let's go! Grab our hose! <gasps> Firefighter Mika is on the way. Grab my hose and save the day. Oh, awesome. We just put out a fire. Oh, that was so much fun. Thanks for helping me. You're very brave. Firefighters are really brave. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Whoa, look, an animal hospital. This is where veterinarians work. Veterinarians are doctors, but for animals. Would you like to be a veterinarian with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. Oh, look at these doors. A small door for turtles and hamsters and gerbils too, and a medium door for bunny rabbits and ducks. Quack, quack, and ferrets and guinea pigs too. And a large door for cats and dogs. 
large and small. Those are opposites. <laughs> cool. Oh, and look at this door for birdies. Oh, that's another opposite. High and low. Low and high. <laughs> Let's pretend to be birds Fly to the vet's office. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> oh, do you hear that? Paging Dr. Mika, you have a patient ready. Okay. Oh, and check it out. Here's our patient. Hello, puppy. How are you today? Little scratches, scratches. Did your family bring you here for a checkup? Oh, awesome. All right, let's get started, boy. We have a stethoscope. Stethoscopes are for hearing what's inside of your body, like your heart. <sighs> oh, may I check your heart too? <gasps> Great. Wow, that sounds nice and strong. Okay, let's check puppy's heart. This might be a little cold. <gasps> wow, that sounds so healthy and strong. You must be getting on your daily walks, huh? Don't forget to hydrate, okay? Doctor's orders. <laughs> oh, being a veterinarian is so much fun. I love helping animals and their families too. <laughs> now that I checked out the whole town, I'm gonna hit the road. Are you ready, Popsicle? <laughs> Let's go, giddy up! <laughs> Thank you so much for exploring different jobs with me today. <laughs> if I had to choose, I'd be a ice cream maker, grocer, animal doctor, firefighter. <laughs> all at once. <laughs> they were all so much fun, I can't just pick one. <laughs> but you know the best part? Exploring with you, friend. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Oh, great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika! <laughs> okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye! Hey, it's me, Mika. And today, I'm at the Paint Place in New York City. Here at the Paint Place, they have a ton of different art supplies. You can make a sculpture or a painting, but I really want to make a mixed media piece. That's where you use a lot of different materials to make one art piece. Let's go. Oh, paint place. <gasps> Come on. Wow, there are so many cool paintings in here. I see an artist. Come on. Hey. I'm Mika, what's your name? I'm Mika, I'm Deirdre. Oh, hi Deirdre, nice to meet you. What do you do here? I'm an instructor at the paint place, I'm an artist. Oh, oh, you're a very good artist. What is this? This is the New York City skyline. <gasps> New York City, that's where we are right now. I think I want to make a skyline too, but I want to do a mixed media piece. Oh, absolutely, you're going to need more supplies though. So okay. why don't you grab it from the table? Oh, all right, thanks, see you soon. Whoa, look at all of these materials that I get to use for my mixed media piece. Oh, oh, here's an apron. That's super important because that way I can protect my clothes from paint or glue. Let me just tie this on. <laughs> look at all the paint that's already on the apron. <laughs> okay, let's see, what do I want to use? Oh, check this out. Do you know what shape this is? It's a circle, and there's a lot of little circles around it. You wanna count the circles with me? Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten little circles. This is a paint palette. You can put different colors of paint in the little circles. <laughs> I definitely need that. Hmm, what else? Oh, some paint brushes for sure. I like these little ones for detailing. Throw those in there. Oh, there's different kinds of ways to apply paint to a canvas. 
You could use a paintbrush or a sponge. That can make a really fun texture. I'm gonna throw that in there. Hmm. Oh, glue. I might need some glue. Let's see. Look at all of these colors. I see some of my favorite colors in here. I'm gonna use, ooh. Purple, oh yeah. Purple in there and hmm. Yellow. <laughs> wow, it would be so cool to have purple and yellow buildings. And this blue is pretty cool too. So purple, yellow, blue. Hmm. Looks like some of these papers are already cut out. Might need some of these. I'll get red and blue and yellow. Throw in some extra. Okay. Whoa, there's felt pieces cut out. Oh, what do we have here? <laughs> Look, there's a person. Hey, do you want to be in my skyline painting? Yes, I do. Oh, great. You can go in there and what kind of shapes are over here? <gasps> a sunshine. My skyline could be during a sunny day. Oh, you're definitely going in there. And some squiggles, those are fun. Throw those in there. I'll just throw them all. Wow, look at all these different colored puffy balls. Woo, they're called pom-poms. Hmm, I think I'm gonna throw some in there. And, oh, I'll definitely need scissors. If you're gonna use scissors, make sure you're with a grown-up. And, ooh, a sponge roller. That could be fun. Another way to apply paint. And, whoa, look at all of these different colors. I'm gonna throw that in there. And, whoa, look at this cool paintbrush. <laughs> the big paintbrush. This one is kind of like a triangle. Ooh, that'll be fun. And some colored pencils. Oh, this is gonna be so colorful. What a great way to remember my day in New York City. I'm missing anything? Oh, I need a canvas. This will do it. All right, let's get started. I'm so excited to make this art piece. Oh, here's an easel. Put my canvas right there. And I'll put my materials over here. Hey. There's other paint here. Look at this bright pink. Ooh, kind of matches my nails. This is acrylic paint, which is different than the watercolor paint that I put in my basket over there. Acrylic paint is thicker than watercolor paint. Watercolor is thinner and transparent, which means you can see through it. Hmm. I think I'm actually gonna use the acrylic paint today. All right. Uh, oh, I'll use my paint palette. So I'm gonna make a sky and water. So I'll need blue. Oh, here's some blue paint right here. Okay. Whoop, see? Nice blue paint. And oh, look at this blue. I love this color. It's kind of like a turquoise or a teal. Put that on there. <gasps> so pretty. And I'll add some black. Ooh. <laughs> and white. There we go. Check it out. And I'll need a paintbrush. Oh, this looks like a perfect paintbrush for my sky and my water. All right, let's get started. <laughs> okay, starting with a blank canvas. I can go anywhere. I'm feeling it. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna start with the sky. So I think I'm gonna use this blue and a little bit of white. Get some water on there. And I have to be careful because acrylic paint could stain my clothes. Good thing I'm wearing an apron. <laughs> so get this beautiful blue sky.
Okay, I think the sky's looking pretty good. And now I'm gonna do the water, the river. Hmm, maybe make the water a little darker than the sky. More blue. And if I add black to it, I can make it a little darker than the sky. Okay, now oh, I see a hair dryer. That's such a smart way to make the paint dry faster. Okay. See? Whoop. I'm gonna dry my paint so then I can add the next material. Oh yeah! Okay, I think that's pretty good. Hmm, my water looks really dark. Oh, I bet if I added some blue to it, it would make it look a little more like water. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, whoops. Okay, I'm gonna add more blue. Let's see, this will brighten it up. Cause it's so dark, it looks like a street almost, but I really want it to be water. And I'm gonna add a little white. always important to clean your brush in between colors. Get some white on there. Wow, so I have sky and water, and I want some clouds up here. <gasps> I can use my fingers to make clouds. Okay, it's so cool how you can use different things to apply paint. And the good thing about a paint apron is you can just ride off. Three puffy clouds. Whoop. All right, let me get. Now let's dry the clouds. Okay, check it out. It's the Empire State Building. I'm gonna have that building in my New York City skyline. <laughs> okay, let's put some buildings on my canvas. Let's get a lot of glue on here so my buildings stick. Here. Look, a yellow rectangle. Rectangles make really good buildings. All right, I finished gluing on my buildings. Now I'm gonna move on to my felt pieces. <gasps> Remember this, friend? Put some glue. All right, what should I name this person? Hmm, I think I'm gonna name him George! George, where do you want to go? Oh, okay. All right, you're a little close to the water, George, but I get it. It's the summer, you want to cool off. And, oh, my sunshine! To find my felt. <gasps> sunshine, there it is. Okay, I'll put the sun up here. Oh, I love it. I think it would be really cool to add some cotton balls to my clouds. There's some over here. Oh, don't these look like clouds? Soft and fluffy and white. All right, let's see what it will look like. Add some here. Yeah, cool, I like it. What do you think? I think the clouds look really cool. And now, I think I'll add some details to the buildings. 
need a small paintbrush. Like this one! Isn't this so fun? It's what's cool about mixed media. You can use all different kinds of materials to make an art piece. Oh, I still have some white paint here. Water in there. And then let's see, maybe this building. We have some windows. Might be an apartment building. Oh, George lives here. George, you have a great building. Nice tenants. Okay, and then maybe some lines here, lines there. This building can have lines like that. And I'm gonna do three lines on this one. One, two, three. What's so cool about art is you can do whatever you want. Details, I think that's pretty good. And I forgot, I have something in my jam pack. Glitter! <laughs> I'm gonna put some glitter on my painting, what do you think? Yeah, all right, I need some glue so the glitter sticks. I think it would look good in the water. Sparkly water. Now my mixed media art piece is all complete. Oh, hey Deidre. Hi, this looks amazing. Thank you, I had so much fun making it. I know the perfect spot where we can hang it up. Really? Yes, yeah, someone's coming to pick up their painting, so why don't we hang up yours? <gasps> I get to be on the wall with the other artists? That's so cool. I hope you enjoyed the paint place. I did, it was so fun. Thanks for having me. Bye. All right, see you later. Well, I feel like a real artist now. <laughs> <laughs> that was so fun! Oh, guess I don't need my apron anymore because I'm all finished with my art piece. <laughs> what a great day at the paint place! I got to make a mixed media art piece using construction paper and felt pieces and paint and <gasps> glitter! Oh, that was so cool! And I even got to hang it up on the wall <laughs> like an official artist. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, it's me, Flippy. Did you see what I was just doing? <laughs> I was acting like a dinosaur. <laughs> That's so silly. Yeah, and today we're at Santa Barbara Museum of Natural History in Santa Barbara, California. And I have a great idea. Why don't you and I go inside and see if we can find some dinosaurs? Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Wow, I'm having a lot of fun. Whoa! <gasps> Look at this! Prehistoric forest? Wow! Prehistoric? Yeah, that was a really long time ago. And actually, at a point of prehistoric times, there was dinosaurs! I love dinosaurs. Do you love dinosaurs? <laughs> yeah! Did you hear that? Yeah, that was a dinosaur roaring! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Oh, what is this? Wow, looks like a really colorful book. I wonder what's inside. Whoa. <laughs> All right. <gasps> wow, there's a letter, a message. It says, find these five dinosaurs in the prehistoric forest. We're there right now. Whoa. Then choose your favorite dino and color it. Whoa, cool! All right, looks like we have to find these dinosaurs. Whoa, cool! There's three dinosaurs. Ooh, four and five. All right, let's find all five of these dinosaurs and then we'll color one. This is gonna be so much fun. Yeah! <laughs>
dinosaur just roared. So cool. Do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Hmm, it does have plates on its back. Huh, I wonder if it's in this book. All right, is it this dinosaur? No, let's see. Oh, what about this one? Definitely not. Could be this one. Close, but that's not it. Huh, what about that one? No. <gasps> Is it this one? Yeah! You can tell by all those plates. Oh, I know what kind of dinosaur this is. It's a stegosaurus. Yeah, I could tell because the plates on its back. Every stegosaurus have at least 17 plates. Yeah, or more. So cool. And they actually are herbivores. That means they eat plants. I like eating plants too. <laughs> yeah, like lettuce or like salad and spinach. Yum! So healthy. <laughs> okay, hey, we should probably check this box off so we can keep track of what dinosaurs we find. All right, made a little X right there. Wow, perfect. Whoa, cool. All right, let's keep exploring and see what other dinosaurs we can find. Yeah! <laughs> see ya! Please do not touch or feed the dinosaurs. <laughs> okay, I definitely won't touch or feed the dinosaurs. Whoa, check it out, another dinosaur. Whoa, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Well, it looks like it has some horns. Oh, there's a baby right there. Hello, hey. All right, let's see if we can find the dinosaur in the book. Is it this dinosaur? Oh, yeah! You're right, it is! All right, we need to mark it off right here. Yeah! Do you know what kind of dinosaur that is? Yeah, it's a Triceratops. Do you know how we know? Yeah, come here, I'll show you. Wow! All right, do you see the horns? Yeah, let's count them together. One, two, Three horns. Yeah, its name is Triceratops. Tri, T-R-I. Tri means three. Yeah, so this is a Triceratops. Wow, good job. <laughs> well, let's keep exploring and see what other kind of dinosaurs we can find. Yeah! Check it out, another dinosaur. Wow, this dinosaur looks so cool. Well, hey, let's see if this dinosaur is in our book. Whoa, hey, dinosaur. <laughs> All right, okay, well, it's not this one. Yeah, because this one's the Triceratops, remember? Yeah. All right, what about one of these two? Is it this one? Definitely not. What about this one? Oh, yeah, it does look like this one. Good job, we found another dinosaur. All right, let's check it off. Put a little X right there. Wow, awesome. <laughs> well, this dinosaur does look really cool, but I don't know the name of this dinosaur. Huh, I wonder what kind of dinosaur this is. Oh, hey, Hi. how are you? I'm Jenna, I'm the director of education. Wow, that's cool. So that means you know a lot about dinosaurs? I do know a lot about dinosaurs. Wow, well my friends and I were just trying to think of this dinosaur's name. Do you know its name? I do, this is an Eoplocephalus. Eoplocephalus, that's hard to say. Wow, do you know any cool facts about this dinosaur? I know a lot of cool facts about this dinosaur. Wow. It's covered in armor from its head all the way down to its tail. Wow. It's got spikes on its back, horns on its head, and even a club tail. Oh yeah, the club tail. Ooh, and the spikes and the horns. Wow, and the really thick armor skin. Why does this dinosaur have all of that? 
Yeah, this dinosaur has all of those features to protect it from predators. Whoa, that's really cool. Well, thank you so much for teaching us the name of this dinosaur and some fun facts. Is there any other dinosaurs that you could show us? Oh, absolutely. All right, let's go. <laughs> Another dinosaur! Yeah! Whoa, this is a really cool looking dinosaur! Wow. Should we check to see if it's in the book? Let's check. All right. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, well, it's not this dinosaur. We already found that dinosaur. Ooh, is it this dinosaur? No. Okay, we found that one. Let's see. What about this dinosaur? Oh, yeah! It is! Wow, good job! Thanks so much for helping us find this dinosaur. All right, let's check it off. There we go. Wow, that's awesome. Well, what kind of dinosaur is this? This is a Parasaurolophus. Parasaurolophus. Wow, that's a hard name to say. And what's that thing on its head? Is that a horn? It's actually not a horn. Oh. It's actually a sinus. A sinus? Like, it connects to the nose? It connects to its nose. Wow, why do they have that? Well, they use it almost like a trombone. They suck in air, and then they blow it out as a really loud, deep sound. Oh, I know what a trombone is. <laughs> cool. Whoa, and look at its mouth. It's really wide. Yeah, it's so it can hold hundreds of teeth. Oh, really? Like, really strong, big, sharp, massive teeth? Well, actually more of a lot of little teeth. <laughs> oh, that's cool. What does it eat with its teeth? It eats lots and lots of plants, a lot of plants. Wow, really? And do they then grow in and then stay there forever? Well, no, they're constantly losing their teeth, kind of like little kids do. And then new teeth grow in and they eat more plants. Wow, that is really cool. Thank you so much for teaching us about these two dinosaurs. <laughs> You're welcome, Blippi. I've got more dinosaur things to do today. All right, <laughs> see you later. Thank you so much. Wow, that was really nice of her. All right, so we found four dinosaurs, but we need to find five dinosaurs. So there must be one more dinosaur around here. <gasps> Another dinosaur. Wow, this dinosaur looks so big and furious. <laughs> All right, let's see if this dinosaur is in our book. All right, it's not that one. <laughs> okay, is it this one? Yeah, it's our last dinosaur. Good job. All right, let's check it off. There we go. Whoa, all right. Hey, do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? Yeah, it's a T-Rex. Tyrannosaurus Rex. So big and fierce, but cute teeny little arms. Whoa. <laughs> and do you see its teeth? Yeah, they are very big and very sharp. Yeah, and they're actually shaped like a banana. Whoa. Wow, T-Rexes are so cool because their jaws are so strong. They're actually the most strongest jawed dinosaur that we know of. Wow, and actually, what we think now, the juveniles, the teenagers of T-Rexes, actually might have had some feathers. Wow, T-Rexes are so cool. <laughs> All right, now let's go pick a dinosaur and color it in. This is gonna be fun, yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Wow, wasn't that so much fun learning about those five dinosaurs? Wow, and they were all so big, and it was cool to learn about what they eat. Whoa, and their teeth. <laughs> all right, let's uh, decide which dinosaur we should color. <laughs> all right, let's see, the Triceratops, or one of these two. Huh, let's see, how about I was supposed to pick my favorite dinosaur out of these five. The T-Rex is pretty cool, but I don't know if I can pick my favorite because they're all so cool. Well, hey, 
why don't we color the Stegosaurus? So then we can color the plates all different colors. Wow. All right, first let's take the green one. Ooh, here you go, Stegosaurus. Ooh, nice green plate. Ooh, how about red? Oh, there you go. Whoa, this is gonna be a very colorful Stegosaurus. Yeah, I used orange, one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> Ooh, we'll use my second other favorite color. Yeah, blue. There we go. Oh, so colorful. Yeah, do you remember what Stegosaurus eat? Yeah, plants because they're herbivores. Ooh, how about pink? Mm. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, pink. Ooh, and let's do the last plate as purple. Whoa, look at that. Now that is a colorful Stegosaurus. <laughs> All right, last but not least, a green scribble. Wee! <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, hey, I have an idea. Why don't we take green and draw a plant right here? Yeah, like it's eating. Ooh, there you go. Kind of hard to see. <laughs> wow. What a great Stegosaurus. Very colorful. They didn't look like this back then, but it still looks really cool. Whoa! That was so much fun learning about dinosaurs with you. I sure do love dinosaurs. What magnificent creatures they were. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah! B-L-I-P-P-I! Flippy! Good job! Alright, well, I'm gonna keep this book right here, so then the next person that comes here, they can color one of their favorite dinosaurs! Yeah! Alright, see you later! Bye bye <laughs> Whoa! Hey! It's me, Blippi, and today, I'm at Discovery Cube in Los Angeles, California! And I am so excited to show you around! But first, I have someone really special to introduce to you! Hey, Blippi! Hey, Mika! <laughs> Hi, everyone! This is Mika, and she's my best friend! Aw, Blippi, you're my best friend! Oh, no, Mika, you're my best oh, friend! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited to go in and explore Discovery Cube! Yeah, let's go! Whoa! Wee! Yeah! Whoa! Whoa. What, what are you Whoa. doing, Mika? I'm being an airplane! Oh, me too! Whoa! I'm acting like a big plane that carries passengers! Oh, wow! I'm gonna be a really little plane! Whoa, now I'll be a jet that goes super fast! Oh, I wanna see! I love planes. Oh, check it out. What's this? Wow, we can make paper airplanes. Cool. Whoa, shall we? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay, let's start with blank white pieces of paper. <laughs> okay, let's fold them. Fold them. Wow. I wonder who's going to fly faster and further. I don't know. Probably yours. We'll have to race them. You're really good at this type of stuff, Mika. Oh, thank you. Flippy? Yeah. I love making paper airplanes. <laughs> oh, that's silly. <laughs> Whoa. Here Ooh. we go. Whoa. Just warming it up. <laughs> Yours looks so good. <laughs> All right, and I am almost done. Whoa. Does it look good? I think your plane's going to go really far. <laughs> really? Check it out. Wow. wow. All right, shall we go see whose plane is more Aerodynamic. Ooh, come on. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. Cool launch pads. Launch pad. And look at these rings. Wow. Maybe this launch pad will launch our paper airplanes and we can make it through the rings. Oh, okay. Good All right. Luck, Three, two, two one, one, go. Whoa. 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 <laughs> yeah. Wow. That was awesome. That was so fun. Let's do that again. Okay. Oh! Wow! Yeah! Do you want to switch launch pads? Sure! Okay. Wow. I'm going to see if mine can go through the big orange circle. Okay, I'm going to aim for that circle too. Okay, ready? Yep. Three, two, two one. 
Whoa! We both missed. That is so silly. <laughs> that was fun racing. Yeah. Should we go over there? Yeah, come on. Looks like we can put some things on our arms and act like airplanes wow. together. Oh, like these? Yeah. Oh, here comes the wind. Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. So windy. to stand up with these on. Yeah. I think the wind was catching it. It was, and it was pushing us back a little bit. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. Yeah. Whoa, yeah. check it out. We're at the competition zone. Yeah, here we get to build our own cars and we can race each other on the <laughs> car track. Yeah. <laughs> Who do you think's gonna win? I don't know. I guess we have to see. Yeah, come on. I'm guessing you're gonna win, Mika. Oh. You're really good. You never Oh, you're pretty fast. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, okay. So the first step, we need to choose a chassis or a base. Yeah. Okay. What base hmm. are you going to use? Let's see. How about... <gasps> yeah. A blue base with an orange stripe. Yeah, kind of like my blue shirt with an orange suspender. Yeah. Whoa. That is a great choice for you, Blippi. <laughs> what about you, Mika? Oh, I really like this one with the two different color blues. See? A light blue and a dark blue stripe in the middle. Whoa, cool. Yeah, I like that. All right, mm -hmm. now for the top. Choose Let's a see. body for your car. Yeah, mm. top, a body? Cool. A body of a car. I like this blue one. Oh, cool. You're going to go all blue, huh? Yeah. Ooh, and then this. Yeah, the body? I will do an orange car with the blue stripe. Yeah, the opposite of the bottom. <laughs> so cool. That's going right. to really nice together. Oh, thanks. Looks like we connect them like this, huh? Oh. Whoa, cool. The magnetics, they stick really well together. Yeah. And what does every car need? Hmm. Wheels. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's pick out some wheels and tires. Right here. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like we need four of them. Probably the same number that your car has. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Here we go. All right. Woo Check it out. Yeah. They're ready to race. <laughs> Looks like we can add some weight to make it heavier. Whoa. Remove weights to make it lighter. Wow. I wonder if that will idea. help. Should we try? Um, sure. I'll try a really small one. What are you gonna try? Hmm. I'll try one. Okay. Two. Alright. I guess. No. Oh! <laughs> a scale! Okay. Let's see. Mine weighs 101.7 grams. Wow. All right, what about yours? Let's find out. 106.5. Even though my car's way bigger. Yeah. <laughs> All right, shall we? Yeah, let's race them. Wow, check it out. This is the racetrack. Hey, it matches my car really well. Oh, yeah, it does. Check it out. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Wow. All right. Now we're at the start of the racetrack. Yep. So let's get our cars ready. And here's the launcher. We have to pull it back. Uh, Can you yeah. want to come down with us? Yeah. Three, two, one. one. Go! Whoa! 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 That was awesome! That was really fun. Who won? I don't know. I think maybe mine by just a second. Oh, oh yeah! Lane one, that's me, 4.1. Lane two, 3.72. Wow. wow! Shall we try it again? Yeah, come on. Okay. Wait, since your car won, do you mind if I try taking this weight off? Oh yeah, let's see if that helps. All right. <laughs> All right, and I'll keep mine on. Let's see if anything changes. Okay. Pull it back. Ready to count down? Three, 
Mika? Wow, here's another racetrack. Wow. Shall we try this one out? Yeah, this one looks really cool. There's turns. Wow, do you want to go first? Sure, thanks. <laughs> okay. Cool. Roll it back. Okay, I can't wait to see it do the loop de loop. <laughs> yeah. Three, two, one, go! Wow, look at it go. Around and around. Yeah, it's going so fast. Oh. Whoa, last corner. Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! Yeah, that was awesome, Mika. Wow, 12.96 seconds. That's right, now it's your turn. <laughs> All right, here we go. Are you ready? Yep. All right, three, two, one, go! Yeah! Whoa, look at it go! Is really cool. Yeah, keep coming. Yeah, just a little bit more. One more turn. Okay. Come on, come on. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. 18.22. Oh, Mika, you totally beat me. Oh, I wonder if it's the weight. <laughs> I don't know. Might be the cool looking blue car. Yeah. Oh, look, green trash. Hey. This time. Okay, ooh, can I borrow it? You want to have this one? Sure! I'll have no weight. All right, and I'll have one weight. <laughs> okay. Here one, we two. go. Yeah! Three, two, two, one, go! Yeah! Yeah, go blue car! Go blue car! Go blue car! Whoa, yeah! Mika, that was awesome! That was a fun one. So fast! All right, try it out. Ready? Three, two, one, go! Yeah! Oh, yeah, it made it! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, that was awesome! Shall we keep exploring? Yeah! Did you see that? Yeah, it went all the way up to the ceiling. And it made a circle. It really did. So cool. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, Ooh, some more cool. smoke. Whoa. Oh. Oh. It's kind of cold. Yeah, it's colder over here. Yeah. Shall we try and get in? Okay. All right. Whoa. Whoa. I can't see Whoa. you. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, it's gone now. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Some windmills. They're so tall. Yeah. And they're spinning because wind is blowing into them. Wow. It's really cool because when wind blows through the propeller type of thing, it harnesses the energy. Yeah, it's really good for the Earth. Yeah. Ooh, and speaking of Earth, yeah, there's a lot of rocks around the Ooh. Earth. And this is a fake rock wall. Yeah. Have you ever tried one? No. You want to? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you go let's first. Try. Okay, let's see. Look here. Whoa. I love being active. Very healthy Look. for you. Whoa. So wow, cool. All right, I'll follow you. All right, let's Can we go. go that way? Sure. All right. A red scarf? Oh. And I have a blue and orange one tied together. Flippy, these are your favorite colors. Oh, yeah, you're right. Ooh, and look, a yellow one. Wow. Ooh, do we have more colors? Yep, here is a purple one. Oh, my God, you love purple. I really do. It's one of my favorite colors. <laughs> yeah, it's the same color as their shirt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and? Oh. Last color. Green. <laughs> Check this out. When we push these buttons, 
lot of wind comes from here all the way up. I don't feel any wind in mine. Really? Let me try again. Now I do. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Now you know what to do. Yep. Here we go. And these scarves are so light, and they just fly up in the air. Yep. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. All right. There we go. Let's go in one last time. Okay. Three, two, one. one. Go. Whoa. Yeah. Woo that was awesome. Wow. Wow. A wind machine. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, I want to try it. Have you ever been inside one? Huh. <laughs> well, it gets really windy. Oh, it's fun. <laughs> All right. Okay. And I got some scratches. All right. Bye, baby. <laughs> Woo, take these. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> <laughs> <Ooh>. Get ready. <laughs> Sure do love learning with you, Mika. Me too. We did so many cool things. Yeah, we learned about some science and some history. Yeah, we raced cars and we raced airplanes. Wow, <laughs> what a fun time. Yeah. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Yep. Will you spell my name with me? Of course. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. <laughs> Good job. Wait a second. Mika. How do you spell your name? Oh, I'll show ya. <laughs> it's M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Cool. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Bye. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we are at Southern Hill Farms in Claremont, Florida. This farm is so cool because they grow flowers and they grow fruit. So today I want to pick some blueberries, make blueberry lemonade, and find some beautiful sunflowers. I love sunflowers because they're yellow, one of my favorite colors. Come with me. Oh, cool. These are buckets that you can use to collect the blueberries in once they're picked. <laughs> That's so fun. Oh, come down here, look at this. <laughs> Have you ever seen sand on a farm before? <laughs> yeah, you might not expect sand at a farm, but this sand that's really soft and fine, it's called sugar sand, and it's really helpful for the blueberries. With this sand, the water can drain quickly, which is super important because blueberries do not grow in a lot of water. So this sand's really fun to play with and touch, but it's really important for the blueberries. So I'll just leave that there. <laughs> Do you want to pick blueberries with me? Let's go. Take a look at this. It's a blueberry bush or a shrub. Here, come a little closer. See, there's oops, <laughs> a stem and the leaves. And look, the fruit, the best part. <laughs> so see how some of these berries, they're different colors. There's kind of a purple, a blue, and a green. Do you know which berry is ripe? <laughs> That's right, this one, the blue one. Those are the ones that you wanna pick. And ripe means that it's fully grown and ready to eat. <laughs> they're so cute. I know, we could pick 20 ripe 
blueberries. Will you count with me? Cool. So we have one. Hmm. Oh, here's another one. Two. Whoop, there's one down here. Three. Four. Almost there. 17. 18. 19. 20. 20 ripe blueberries. Thanks for counting with me. See, you can pick them off of the bush or you can pick them up off the ground as long as they're nice, blue, and ripe. <laughs> oh. This is gonna be really good in my blueberry lemonade. You can do all sorts of things with blueberries. What do you like to do with blueberries? You could make jam or jelly for a blueberry and peanut butter sandwich, or you can make a smoothie, blueberry pancakes, cupcakes, parfaits, juice. There's so much you can do with blueberries. <sighs> Should we keep looking at blueberries? All right, cool. Let's go over there, there's more. Wow, look, it's a baby blueberry shrub. See, it's much smaller than the other plants we saw, but one day it's gonna grow nice and big and full and have a ton of blueberries on it. You'll notice on the young plants, they have little flowers, see? <laughs> so cute. Oh, I see another ripe blueberry. Here, take a look. See how? Kind of looks white on the outside. That's called bloom. And bloom is like a sunblock for blueberries. It protects it against the sun so the blueberries don't get too much sun. <gasps> Check it out! A really big yellow slide. Oh, I have to go down. Let me put my blueberries down so I don't spill any and I'm nice and safe. Come on. Whoa! I get it. You use the potato sack to go down the slide. See, you put your feet in here in the bottom, get situated, and then you woo, woo, woo. <laughs> oh, look at this. You must be this tall to ride alone. All others must ride with an adult. All right, let's see. Oh, I think I'm tall enough to ride alone. <laughs> let's check it out. Hey, whoa, it's really high up. This is quite the climb. This slide is gonna be awesome. Look how high we are. You can see the entire farm. <laughs> okay, only slide feet first. Okay, that was my plan anyway. All right, so you lay your potato sack down like this. Sit down and feet first. Feet will go in this little pocket here. <gasps> okay, do you wanna watch me slide all the way down to the bottom? All right, see you there. <laughs> Three, two, one, slide! Woo! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that was so fast, that was awesome. <laughs> all right. Let's put this over here. And oh, my blueberries. Oh, there they are. All right, come on, blueberries. And you come too. There's more fun things to do. Oh, check it out. It's a carousel. Have you ever been on a carousel before? <laughs> well, let's go. Blueberries down and go for a ride. Hmm. Oh, I love this horse. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at this yellow.
yellow hair. Oh, one of my favorite colors. All right, I'm ready, horse. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah, on the other side. We were going up to a stop. Wait till it gets to a complete stop before you get off the horse. That's the safest thing to do. And we're stop. <laughs> that was so fun. Let's see what else we can find here. Wow, this is a huge jumping pillow. <laughs> Come on, let's see. Whoa, super bouncy. Can you imagine if this was really a pillow? Ooh. Good night. <laughs> Whoa, let's see, what can I do on here? Whoa, I can do one of my all time favorite things, a cartwheel. Ready? Woohoo! Oh, I can also do a round off. <laughs> Whoa, hey, you can jump with me. What's one of your favorite jumps? You can do this. Woohoo! You could do it on the other side. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm so excited to make blueberry lemonade. I already made a lot of lemonade right here. To make lemonade, you need lemons. And you need sugar to make it sweet because the lemons are pretty sour. And you need some water. But I think we need one more lemon to go into this lemonade. So let me cut one here. I'll show you how you get the juice out. And remember, only grown-ups should be using knives. Okay, so cut this in half like that. And this is a juicer. I'm gonna add that to the picture that I already made before. Yum! Okay, and my favorite part, we have some juice from the blueberries that you helped me pick earlier. We washed the blueberries and we juiced them and now I have some yummy blueberry juice to add to this lemonade. All right. Whoa, <laughs> isn't that such a pretty color? All right, now we'll take a spoon and stir it up. Mmm, smells sweet and fruity. Hey, okay, think that's pretty good. And I have a cup here so I can taste it. I have to make sure it tastes good. All right, whoops. <laughs> and, oh, I should add some extra blueberries to make it really special. Mmm. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's really, really tasty. Oh, I love blueberries so much. Okay, so, I picked blueberries, I made blueberry lemonade, What's the other thing that I wanted to do? <gasps> Find sunflowers, that's right. I wonder if there are sunflowers around here. I have these binoculars. They'll help me look a little closer. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Where are the sun? <gasps> I see sunflowers down there. Let's get a closer look. Come on.
found the sunflowers. Oh, there's a really big one down here. Wow, it's so pretty. See, the inside looks like the sun and the petals all around look like sun rays. Isn't that cool? Like a big, beautiful sunshine. And speaking of sunshine, did you know that sunflowers are attracted to the sun? So if the sun is shining over here, a sunflower will look like this. <laughs> and if the sun is shining over there, the sunflower will look like this. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, they're so beautiful. So I think we did everything that we planned. Let's see. We picked blueberries, we made blueberry lemonade, and we found sunflowers. <laughs> we did it. Thank you for your help. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you next time. Bye. and look at what's behind me. Whoa, a blue and yellow airplane. Yeah. Did you see how I was acting like an airplane? Woo I sure do love airplanes. But hey, today I'm at the Museum of Flight in Seattle, Washington. And today you and I are gonna learn about airplanes. Yeah, let's go. Welcome to Blippi Airlines. Where are you heading today? Wow, that sounds like a great destination. Is it for business or pleasure? <laughs> awesome. All right, uh, let's see. You are all checked in. Do you have a bag? <laughs> okay, perfect. Ooh, thank you. <laughs> okay, let's put the bag on the scale. All right, looks like you're within the limitation. So let me put this on the conveyor belt. Well, have a great flight. But wait a second, that sounds like so much fun. Do you mind if I come? <laughs> Perfect, all right. <laughs> there we go. Now I have a ticket too. Okay, let me come around. <laughs> I am so excited for our trip together. <laughs> hey, we have to go through security, all right? <laughs> oh, did you hear that? Oh, that means I must have something I shouldn't have on me. Oh, I know what it is. It's just my cell phone. <laughs> All right, I'll put that there. <laughs> Come on. All right, here we go. <laughs> Perfect, let's go. Wow, look at the airplane. Whoa, look at the fuselage, the cabin, and look at the tail up there. Whoa, this is gonna be such a fun flight. All right, let me put your bag down right here. There you go, bag. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Yeah, a fuel truck. Whoa, check it out. Fuel. <laughs> All right, let's grab the hose and let's make sure that the airplane has a lot of fuel. Here we go, let's connect it. Oh, perfect, it's full. All right, here we go. Okay, now that the aircraft has a lot of fuel, now we can Buckle up. Okay, first let's put on our seatbelt. There we go. Okay, now we'll listen for instructions for the flight. <laughs> Thank you for choosing Blippi Airlines. Please mind the aisles and be sure to find the nearest emergency exit. Buckle your seatbelt and make sure it's nice and tight. And in case you need an air mask, it will come down from above. All right, now that we got the safety briefing and passengers are seated, now I think I should fly the airplane. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Wow, so many cool gauges and instruments. Whoa, all right, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> yeah. Whoa, check it out. See this airplane? It's so big! 
Yeah! I am way smaller than this airplane. And do you see what these are? Yeah! These are called wings. Most airplanes have two wings that go from the side, but not all of them. <laughs> Some have more. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. See, the main body of the airplane is called the fuselage. Wow, this airplane is actually used to put people inside and transport them from one location to the other location. Just like, say, a car or a boat or a bicycle, but way quicker. But hey, remember how I said this airplane is so big? Here, come follow me and I have another airplane for you. And it is not very big. Remember how I said that plane is really big? Check this one out. Whoa, yeah, this plane is small. <laughs> well, it's smaller compared to that plane, but I'm sure there's smaller airplanes than that one. But hey, what colors do you see on it? Yeah, red, white, and blue. <laughs> yeah, woohoo! <laughs> oh, and what shape is that? Oh, yeah, that looks like a star. Whoa, this plane looks like it goes so fast. Whoa! Whoa, check it out. This engine actually goes to an aircraft. Yeah, but there's no outside casing around it. Whoa, it is so big. Look how big it is compared to me. And do you see everything in there? There's so many hoses and tubes and... Oh, geez. So the air goes in right here, gets compressed, fire, and then boom! Whoa! These tires are so big! And there's actually two tires right there. Yeah, we're at the front of the aircraft. So let's head to the back of the aircraft and see how many tires are back here. Whoa! Do you see them? Whoa! There's so many more tires back here. Wow, this plane must be really heavy. Yeah, that's probably why they have so many tires. Whoa, and look how big this wing is. If it was raining, I definitely would not get wet. <laughs> Whoa, check out this airplane. It looks like it goes really fast. Hey, what color of airplane is it? Yeah, you're right. It's blue with a little bit of yellow. <laughs> Good job. Whoa, look at how big that airplane is. Whoa, do you see the colors of it? Yeah, it's white, red, and gray. Let's go find some more colors. Whoa, look at this airplane. Do you see something different with it? Yeah, there's two wings over here. And there's two on the other side. Yeah, so it has two sets of wings. That's really cool. But hey, we're here to learn the color of it. <laughs> what color is this airplane? Yeah, you're right. You said green. Good job. <laughs> And look out on the wing We're gonna fly, fly, fly Till we can touch the sky We're gonna soar right through the clouds We're gonna fly, fly, fly We're going way up high On the airplane in the sky We're going to fly Get your passport, get your luggage too, we're going 
going on an adventure Wear your seatbelt Feel the plane taking off and take in the view So keep that worrying engine better look out on the wing We're gonna fly, fly, fly till we can touch the sky We're gonna soar right through the clouds We're gonna fly, fly, fly We're going away learning about airplanes with you today at the Museum of Flight in Seattle, Washington. <laughs> do you like airplanes? Yeah, I do too. They're so cool how high they fly in the sky. And how they're small airplanes and big airplanes. Wow. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> Will you spell my name with me? B L I P P I. Blippi! Good job! Alright, see you again! Bye bye! Hi! It's me, Mika! And today I'm at the American Museum of Natural History in New York City. Do you know what's inside of this museum? all different kinds of animals and dinosaurs. And I heard that they have one of my favorite dinosaurs, a T-Rex. Do you know what a T-Rex looks like? I have one in my jam pack. Whoa, here it is. <laughs> hey, will you come with me and see if we can find a T-Rex inside? Let's go. Whoa, I'm inside of the museum. I can't wait to find the T-Rex. Whoa! That is definitely not the T-Rex. Do you know what that is? It's a blue whale! Oh, and look, I see a bandage on that whale. <laughs> Even whales get boo-boos. <laughs> Did you know that the blue whale is the biggest animal on the planet? <laughs> it's so cool! <laughs> oh, I see someone over there who works at the museum. I bet they have more whale facts. Come on! Hi. Hello. I'm Mika. What's your name? Alexandra. Hi, Alexandra. So I bet you know something about the blue whale. Yes. You do? What do you do here? I'm an educator. Oh, an educator. So yeah, you definitely know. Um, what do blue whales eat? Blue whales eat tiny krill. Whoa. Look at these tiny shrimps. Can you believe a big blue whale likes to eat these tiny little shrimps? <laughs> <laughs> Wow, well, do blue whales have teeth like us? No, they don't have teeth. They have baleen. Baleen? Oh, whoa, it feels like straw. Can you imagine if you had straw in your mouth instead of teeth? Ugh, <laughs> so how do they eat? They open up their mouth. Okay. Very, very big. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. They take a cup of water, <gasps> put krill in it. Mm -hmm. Then they push the water out with their tongue. And what's inside? The grill. Mm. Mm. Cool. <laughs> that seems really complicated. That is not how I eat at all. Wow. And what is that? It looks like a big bone. This is a part of the well vertebrae. The vertebrae. Well, mm. we have those. You can yeah. feel it in your back. Yeah. Can I hold it? Yes, sure. Whoa. Oh, this is so heavy. Look how big this is. Ours are so tiny. Blue whales are huge. <laughs> okay, here, I'll give that back to you. you. Wow, well, thanks for sharing those facts with us. I'm gonna keep exploring, but maybe I'll see you later. See you later. All right, awesome, <laughs> come on. Where is the T-Rex? Where, where is the T-Rex? Whoa. That is not the T-Rex, but it is a very large mammal. Do you know what it is? 
It's a walrus. Oh, not a real walrus, this is just a model. But this looks pretty much exactly like a real walrus. Whoa, do you see those big tusks? They're made out of ivory and they're really strong and really sharp. And that one looks like the size of my arm, maybe even bigger. Look, can you imagine if you had something that big hanging out of your mouth? Could you even find a toothpick big enough to clean that thing? <laughs> they can use them when they're in the water to poke into the ice and pull their bodies up. Very helpful. <laughs> Will you act like a walrus with me? Okay, get your tusk out. <clears throat> Let's keep looking for the T-Rex. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Walrus out. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> You're so funny. That's why you're my favorite. That is why you are my favorite dinosaur. <laughs> oh, hey. I'm still trying to find the T-Rex, but I don't see any dinosaurs anywhere. <laughs> Let's keep looking over here. Maybe we can find something. <gasps> Whoa. Gorillas. <gasps> Gorillas are super cool. They're really big. They're really strong. They're hairy. They can stand up tall just like humans. But the male gorilla is 10 times stronger than a human. That's pretty strong. <laughs> Will you act like a gorilla with me? All right, let me see your muscles. Pound your chest. Let's keep looking for more animals. Whoa, yeah, I feel strong just acting like a gorilla. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. See in the back there, a giraffe. Giraffes are so tall. They can get up to 18 feet tall. That's really, 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 really tall. And they have super long black tongues. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Do you know what that animal is? That's right, a zebra. Zebras are awesome. They have black and white stripes and a group of zebras is called a dazzle. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Check out that dazzle of zebra over there. <laughs> they run super fast and they can run in zigzags. Will you zigzag with me? All right, let's go. Run in zigzag. <laughs> Whoa, elephants are so big, so they have to eat a lot of food. Actually, most of their day is filled with eating. They're herbivores, so they're vegetarians. They don't eat meat. Oh, and look, big tusks, just like those walruses. <laughs> hey, will you act like an elephant with me? Get your trunk out. Ready? <laughs> Maybe you can stomp like an elephant. <gasps> big cats are lions. I love lions because they have really big roars. Kind of like the T-Rex. <laughs> See that one with the mane, all of the hair? That's a male lion. That's how you know, because it has a mane. The other lions that don't have manes are females. And a group of lions is called a pride. <laughs> I still don't see any dinosaurs though. Will you keep looking with me? All right, come on. Wow, we're in the dinosaur room. There has to be a T-Rex here, right? That means yes. <laughs> Let's keep looking. Oh, there's a dinosaur over there. Ah, oh, long tail, lots of teeth, but that's pretty small. A T-Rex is way bigger than that dinosaur. It's almost as little as this toy dinosaur. Hello. <laughs> hmm. Oh, look at this dinosaur. Whoa, it has a long neck. Its head is going back really far. Oh, I wonder if it's a dancing. <laughs> nice moves, but not a T-Rex. Hmm. I can't see the T-Rex anywhere. Do you see a T-Rex? Looks like this, big head, so many teeth, really big talons. <gasps> it's right there, the T-Rex, my favorite dinosaur. <gasps> Whoa, look how big the head is. See 
those big jaws with tons of teeth? Wow, they're so sharp and there's so many of them. Did you know that the T-Rex could have up to 50 to 60 teeth in its mouth? That's a lot of teeth. <laughs> Whoa, you can see the whole body of the T-Rex. The head, the ribs, the big legs, the big feet. Roar! Roar! <laughs> oh, hello. Hi. Hi, I'm Mika, what's your name? Hi, my name is Alana. Hi, Alana, what do you do here? I'm a museum educator. Whoa, a museum educator, so you must know a lot about dinosaurs. I do. Oh, cool, well, I'm really excited because my favorite dinosaur is the T-Rex. I really like the T-Rex also. Oh yeah? Well, yeah, what's one of the reasons you love the T-Rex? I like the T-Rex because it was one of the biggest predators. Wow, I know, it's very cool, the T-Rex is Huge, has a really big head and legs and a really big tail. You know, they use that big tail to help them balance. Oh yeah, that's right, because their heads are really heavy, right? Really big heads. Yeah, so the tail helps them balance. Like that. You know what else I like about the T-Rex? What? Look at this big foot here. Whoa, is this a real foot of a T-Rex? This is a model. Okay, okay. But this is like an exact replica. Yeah, you can see how big it was. Whoa, am I allowed to touch it? You can touch it. Okay. Wow, look at these toenails. <laughs> They're so big and pointy. So they had three big toes uh -huh. on their back foot. You know what else I like about the T-Rex? What? How big their teeth were. Oh yeah, they have really big teeth. Look at this. <gasps> Whoa. Look how big this tooth is. This is a model of a real T-Rex tooth. Wow, can you imagine if your teeth were this big? Look, is it the same? <laughs> That's really big. What do you think they might have liked to eat with a tooth this big? Oh, probably meat, yeah. right? They were carnivores. Oh, so they were meat eaters. Cool, right. and what's this? It looks like a big rock. It is a rock, except it's a very special rock. Oh, why? This is a fossil of a dinosaur bone. A real dinosaur a bone? A real dinosaur bone. Would you like to touch it? Yes, please. It's heavy. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see. Okay, all right, it's a little heavy, but it's a real fossil of a dinosaur bone. That's amazing. And what part of the dinosaur is this? That was from their leg or their thigh bone. Oh, so like <laughs> down here. Right there. Wow, that's amazing. Thanks for sharing this with me. Yeah. So is the T-Rex the biggest dinosaur? It wasn't the biggest dinosaur, but this museum has a model of one of the biggest dinosaurs. What, can we see it? You wanna go see it? Yeah. Let's go. All right, come on. Wow. Whoa, it's so big. Whoa. It keeps going and going and going. This is called a titanosaur. Titanosaur, wow, it's really cool. So the titanosaur family was a group of dinosaurs that were sauropods and herbivores. Oh, I know what a sauropod is. That means it walked on four feet. That's right. Ooh. <laughs> and an herbivore means that it was a plant eater. That's right. Yeah, very neat. Now this titanosaur is over 120 feet long. Whoa. Or 37 meters, <laughs> that's and, really long. And it weighed almost as much as 10 elephants. Whoa, 10 elephants, that's very, very heavy. Wow. But you know what's cool about this one? This one was just a juvenile, which means it's kind of like a teenager. Whoa, so it's not even fully grown? It gets bigger than this? It does. Wow, that's incredible. Thank you so much for showing me this, showing me this titanosaur. I had fun with you. I have to go teach a class. Oh, but I'll see you soon. Okay, see ya, thanks again. Wow, what a fun day. We got to see so many cool animals like that big blue whale and walruses and lions and we got to see my favorite dinosaur of all time, the T-Rex. <laughs> Did you have a fun day? <laughs> Me too. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna have more fun and see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. 
Mika. <laughs> All right, we'll see you next time. <sighs> <laughs>、me, Mika. Today I'm at Discovery Children's Museum in Las Vegas, Nevada. This place has so many fun things to learn about. I love learning about art and science by tinkering with things to see what'll happen. <laughs> That's called an experiment. Yeah, let's do cool experiments together. One, two, three, four. Are you ready to explore? Great, let's go. Whoa, water world! I bet there are some cool experiments here. <gasps> Let's move our bodies like water. Come on! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this tall tower. I bet it does something really cool. <gasps> the ramps help move the water down to these two big circles. Check it out. One circle is yellow. And the other is orange. Oh, the yellow one is moving a lot faster than the orange one. And look, let's count the ramps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ramps. Oh, and look, some balls. Huh? I wonder what'll happen if we put the ball in here. Let's try it. Whoa! Check it out. The green ball is moving on the ramp. Let's see where it goes. Wow! It's a ball pit. There are so many colorful balls in here. Red and yellow and green too. <laughs> That was so amazing. Water can do so many things. Like make sounds. What is that sound? Let's go find out. <laughs> wow! Check out these musical chimes. Huh? I wonder how we can make it make music. Let's experiment and find out. Oh, <gasps> do you hear that? <laughs> yeah. Oh. <gasps> The water is hitting the ball in the chimes and making music. Clink, 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 clink. <laughs> That is so cool! <laughs> oh, and look at this one over here. Hmm, these chimes are a little different. I wonder what sounds they'll make. Oh, <gasps> oh, whoa! Oh, it makes a sound when it's in the water too. Sounds like a rushing river. <laughs> okay, let's flow over there. <laughs> Whoa! Check out these wheels. Hmm, they have different shapes. I wonder what that means. <laughs> I got it. Let's do a race. All right, back it up. Back it up. Are you ready? On your mark. Get set. Go! And they're off. All right, they're going fast. Wow, the one with the cups is going much faster. <laughs> cool. Hey, I wonder what that is. Whoa! I wonder what these are for. Hmm. <gasps> Check it out. This one looks like slices of pizza. I'd like a slice. <gasps> <laughs> Let's see what happens when we do this. Oh wow! It turns the water into different shapes, and it comes out different ways. Let's try this one next. <laughs> Check it out! It's a fountain. <laughs> the harder I press, the higher it goes. Whoa! <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, and look at these wheels. Hmm. I wonder what happens if we spin them. Wow. Do you see those bubbles? Cool. Let's spin them together. 
behind me? I wonder how it works. Hmm. Oh, look! It has blue straps that are attached with hooks. I think the blue straps are so you can lift the car up. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, look! Pick it up lever. <laughs> yeah! This must be a lever experiment. Ooh, let's go check it out. The bar balances the weight so that you can lift it with little effort. <laughs> Should we lift this car with the lever? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh, I wonder what'll happen when I pull this rope. Let's see. Whoa! <laughs> I lifted the car all by myself. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. We did it, we did it. We never ever quit it. We did it. <laughs> Wow, levers are pretty cool. Hey, check out those stairs. I wonder where they lead. Let's go find out. Oh. Oh, this is a music room. Did you know when you hear a sound, it moves through your ear canal and makes vibrations that tell your brain what you're hearing? <laughs> yeah, very cool. And look, this room has so many things we can make music with and different sounds. Let's give it a try. Oh, I wonder what would happen if we press this yellow button. <laughs> Let's find out. Whoa! Check it out! This has air! Let's put it over here. Look, it's a music note. The note E. <laughs> Let's try this green one. Oh, that's the note F. Okay, Blue, what do you have? A G. Okay, Purple. That's a low note. <laughs> and another C. <laughs> wow, that was cool. Look, do you know what this shape is? That's right, it's a triangle. Triangles have three sides. One, two, three. And they can make music too. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. Whoa. Oh, that sounds awesome! <laughs> Check it out! 
This is so colorful. Hmm. What happens if we hit this with this yellow stick? Let's see. Oh, another note. Wow. Let's drag it across. <laughs> so cool. Whoa. Look, it's drums. Hmm. Let's count how many drums there are. One, two, three, four, five drums. Oh, this beat makes me want to move my feet. Hey, I got it. Let's make a song. I'll give us a beat. Hey, I'm Mika, and I'm here to say I love exploring and tinkering away. Hey. Give it a shot, try it out, see what it's about. <laughs> Drum roll, please, for the grand finale. Yeah! Whoa! This place is so colorful. <laughs> I bet they have lots of things to tinker around with here. <laughs> What's this? Hmm, it kind of looks like a chalkboard. Let's confirm. Yep, a chalkboard. <laughs> Great job, scientist. <laughs> oh, and look, it rotates. That means it spins. Oh, let's spin and draw. That was fun. Let's keep exploring. <laughs> wow. Let's draw on this. <laughs> Whoa! Look! <laughs> Do you know what color this is? <laughs> yeah, yellow. One of my favorite colors. Ooh, let's erase now. <laughs> oh, erase! Now let's draw with this color. Do you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, blue. Hmm, let's see if you can guess what this is. Can you guess? <laughs> yeah, they're waves, just like down in Water World. <laughs> okay, what else did we draw? <gasps> hey, I know, let's draw some shapes. <laughs> I like yellow. Do you know what this is? Yeah, a triangle. Just like when we were playing the triangles. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> okay, how about this one? <laughs> yeah, it's an oval. <laughs> okay, one more. <laughs> Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> That's right, it's a shining star. <laughs> okay, let's erase and keep exploring. Whoa, what's this? Oh, we can build something out of these pieces. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Ooh, I wonder what's in here. <laughs> Whoa, this is really bendy. <laughs> Ooh, Let's make another bridge. Two bridges. <laughs> Ooh, let's make a third bridge. Wow. Okay, those connect there. Hmm, I think I need a couple more pieces. This'll work. One more. <laughs> there we go. Whoa, look at all these bridges. <laughs> let's go through it. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Got it? Let's make a flower garden. <laughs> Ooh, this could be a rose. <gasps> and this can be a daisy. <laughs> Perfect little flower garden. <gasps> Check out all this art. <laughs> Whoa. <gasps> Look, a beach ball. 
Okay, I'm gonna throw it to you, friend. Ready, set, oh, awesome catch. Okay, throw it back to me. Whoa, <laughs> good job. Check out these instruments. Let's play them. <laughs> oh, and look, a guitar. Pluck, pluck, pluck. Ding, 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 ding. <gasps> Do you see that dog? <laughs> yeah, it must be someone's pet. Oh, good girl. <laughs> well, that was fun. <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> This place is amazing. We learned so much by doing experiments and trying things out for ourselves. We played with water. We lifted a whole car with a lever. And we tinkered around with some music and art. We did a lot. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye. Woo! Whoa, and it looks like there's a dino behind me. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Dinosaur. <laughs> Do you know what kind of dinosaur this is? <laughs> yeah, it's a Tyrannosaurus Rex or T-Rex. <laughs> they were really big dinosaurs. 40 feet long, 12 feet tall, <laughs> and lived a really long time ago. <laughs> I like T-Rexes because they have really big heads and really teeny tiny arms. <laughs> Let's go find some more dinosaurs. Ooh. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> we're here at a dig site. Yeah, where we can dig up and discover fossils. <laughs> oh, and good thing I have my trusty brush. Yeah, when you're digging up fossils, you don't want to use a shovel or your hands. You want to use a brush so it's nice and gentle because breaking a fossil could mean losing precious information for a scientific discovery. <laughs> yeah, we basically don't want to break the fossils. Well, <laughs> here we go. <laughs> Oh, let's see what we can find. Oh, brushing away. <laughs> Brush, whoa, whoa, check it out. It's a fossil. <laughs> I wonder if this is a dinosaur. What kind of creature this could be? Whoa, hmm, whoa, <laughs> check it out. Huh, are those fingers? Whoa, <laughs> this looks really cool. Gotta keep brushing. Whoa! Did you know that people who work to study dinosaurs, they're called paleontologists. <laughs> yeah, I really like dinosaurs, but I'm not a paleontologist. Yeah, paleontologists, they know all about fossils and dinosaurs. Whoa, they study dinosaurs every day. <laughs> That's a lot of dinosaurs. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> It's a dinosaur bone. Whoa, it looks like we found a foot and we found the body. <laughs> I wonder what's over here. Oh, we're getting closer, we're getting closer. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Look, we found its face. Hello, <laughs> hello little dinosaur. Well, this isn't a little dinosaur. This looks like a big dinosaur. It looks like a Stegosaurus. <laughs> Hello, Stegosaurus. Whoa, that's awesome. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> this looks like a really, really big bone, but this isn't a bone, it's a fossil. Hello. <laughs> yeah, well, a fossil might look like a bone, but what happens is a bone falls on the ground and then dirt and mud covers it up. <laughs> then that bone decomposes, it goes away. But there's still that space where the bone was and sediment and different material fills it up and turns into a rock. And then a really long time in the future, <laughs> we find it just like this. 
And that's a fossil that scientists can use to learn about dinosaurs. <laughs> Whoa, check this one out. <laughs> this is a really small fossil. Huh, hmm. This doesn't really look like a dinosaur. Hmm, doesn't really look like a bone either. I wonder what it is. Ooh, I don't know what this is, but I bet if we ask a dino expert, he can tell us. <laughs> hey, let's go find a dino expert. Hmm, I wonder what this is. <laughs> Whoa, I really wish I knew what this fossil was. Hmm, Ooh, I see someone, maybe they know. <laughs> Hi, I'm Blippi, what's your name? Hi Blippi, I'm Kevin, oh. and I'm a dino expert. Whoa, no way! It is so nice to meet you, Kevin. <laughs> Kevin's a dino expert. Maybe he knows what this is a fossil of. <laughs> Whoa, well, Kevin, we found this fossil, but I don't know what it is. Oh, yeah, I can totally tell you what this is. This is actually a tooth of an Edmontosaurus. Oh, a tooth? <laughs> Whoa, we didn't know what it was, but it's a tooth of an Edmontosaurus? That's right, yeah, that's this animal right here. Whoa, check it out! <laughs> The Edmontosaurus is so big! <laughs> oh, and look, it does have some teeth up there, and it looks like it has a duck bill. Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> yeah, that duck bill was actually used to peck at leaves and pull them off the trees. Whoa, that is amazing! Huh, did it just eat leaves or other things too? Uh, no, this was an herbivore, which means it only eats plants. Whoa, yeah. Some dinosaurs were herbivores. <laughs> that means they like to eat lots of plants but others were carnivores. <laughs> they like to eat meat and some were omnivores. Yeah, that means they eat meat and vegetables and leaves and plants. <laughs> Whoa, oh, but this tooth looks like lots of teeth. Is this just one tooth? This is just one tooth. It looks like that because uh, this Edmontosaurus used to grind up its food to make it easier to eat. Whoa, <laughs> that's awesome. Hey, that kind of reminds me of a cow. <laughs> Whoa, that's a pretty cool Edmontosaurus. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. Its legs are so big. <laughs> Looks like it's really good at walking. <laughs> yeah, it is, actually. It used to walk on all fours, but if it needed to get higher, uh, like to get trees, leaves off of the trees, uh, it would stand up on two legs to get more height. Wow, did you hear that? <laughs> it could stand up just like you and me, or walk on all fours just like a little puppy dog. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, and I had one other question, Kevin. Yeah? Do all dinosaurs walk on the land? They do, actually. Oh. Yeah. Well, what about dinosaurs that fly in the air or are in the water? Those actually aren't considered dinosaurs. They're oh. called prehistoric creatures. Whoa. Prehistoric creatures. Whoa. <laughs> And I really hope I can see a prehistoric creature one day. <laughs> hmm. Well, do you know of any prehistoric creatures? I do actually have another one right here. And you know what? He's a little lonely. He needs a friend. Whoa, check it out. It's a prehistoric creature. Whoa. <laughs> and what kind of creature is this? This one's a trilobite. Whoa, a trilobite. <laughs> Well, we need to find this trilobite a friend. <laughs> well, thank you, Kevin, for showing me the trilobite and this amazing dinosaur. <laughs> this was so much fun. <laughs> I'll see you later, Kevin. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Let's go find a friend. <laughs> Whoa, there are so many amazing fossils here, just like our little trilobite. Hello. <laughs> yeah, keep your eye out. We might need to find him a friend. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> Oh, there's a person. Maybe they can help us. Hi. Hi, Blippi. I'm Laura. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Laura. <gasps> Whoa, and what is that? This is a trilobite, a really big one. Whoa, look. We have a little small trilobite and a really, really big one. <laughs> it's so big. And I bet they're going to be great friends. Oh, yeah. Hey, good friends like to dance. Let's do the trilobite dance. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> these trilobites are really good dancers. <laughs> wow, this is a really amazing fossil. Yeah, and 
These trilobites, they lived underwater? They did. They are prehistoric arthropods, which means that they're related to bugs and crabs. Whoa, did you hear that? This isn't a dinosaur, no. A trilobite is an arthropod? An arthropod. <laughs> Whoa, that is a really big name. It <laughs> is. But it just means that the trilobite is a really, really old bug. <laughs> Whoa, and check it out. Laura, is this a dinosaur? No, actually, this is a prehistoric marine reptile. <laughs> Whoa, a prehistoric marine reptile? So it's not a dinosaur? No, it's not. Dinosaurs lived on land, but there are other creatures that flew in the sky and swam in the sea, like yeah. this one. This is Tylosaurus. Ooh, hello, Tylosaurus. <laughs> hey, this is a Tylosaurus. This is a Tylosaurus. Yeah, <laughs> it's a Tylosaurus. Ooh, let's give it a name. We should call this Tylosaurus Tyler. <laughs> I think that's a great name. Hello, Tyler. Hi, Tyler. <laughs> hmm. And it looks like Tyler has a lot of teeth. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> and do you see? Tyler is really, really big. <laughs> he looks almost as big as a T-Rex. <laughs> he is. He's almost the same length as a T-Rex. You could call him the T-Rex of the ocean. Whoa, check him out. <laughs> Wow. He's really cool. Do you see that spot on his jaw that looks like a break? It's actually not a break in his jaw, it's a hinge. Tylosaurus could unhinge its jaw to swallow prey whole. Whoa, did you hear that? Tyler can unhinge his jaw. <laughs> yeah, you've probably seen a hinge before. Yeah, a hinge goes like this. <laughs> Doors have hinges and Tyler has a hinge for his jaw so he can open up really wide. Woo! <laughs> to eat lots of yummy food. <laughs> well, thank you so much for teaching me all about prehistoric creatures. <laughs> I'll see you later, Laura. Bye. There you go. <laughs> OK, let's keep looking for some more dinosaurs and fossils. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs>